Hi everybody. Um, sorry about the confusion, but I guess Scatminder updated their site. So, <clears throat> excuse me. We're at Scatminder site here, and dollar. Oops. <laughs> there we go. Dollar store is where it was. I'll go there just to show you. And see, it's still there. All right, we'll go back. And we're going to go to the Gapminder tools. So it basically looks like it did, except there's a difference. All the research that you've already done, you can still use the same headings. You just access them differently. Down at the bottom is income. You might want to leave that as income per capita. But over here, you can change this to anything that you want. By clicking on it, you can come over. Let's do child mortality, or we'll go down to health here. Come straight out and then select anything from here. We'll say life expectancy of females. Wait for it. It will start to materialize. It'll gather the data. There's life expectancy for females over income. And again, then pick the countries, Albania, uh, Belgium, Bolivia. I'm just arbitrarily selecting, of course. And then we'll go down to Egypt. And let's get down into something like Morocco. Let's say that. Okay. And so if you were to play this now, play, it will then follow along and you can see how it looks just like what I had shown in the first video on the assignment. Okay, so once you have what you're happy with, now what you can do, let's see if I can remember now what I had to do to do that, you can deselect. See how I've moved this down, now you can't see any of the other countries. If I go way up here to select, they're all the same color, so please, all the way down to deselect, so only the countries that you choose show up and then up here it says share go to this one right here it looks like an airplane it's the second one on the right click it it's gonna pull you up this copy the following link so I'm gonna copy I'm gonna pull up a word document and I'll paste wait for it And there it is. So, I'm going to come back here and go cancel. I'm going to go back there and cancel. <laughs> I'm going to knock myself out of here. I'm going to close it. And I am now going to minimize this and just click on this. It's going to offer me, or you know, I want a Mac, so yours might do something different, but it goes directly to the site. And it's going to show me the very same um, map that I just finished copying and saving. So let's let it load up here. And there they are. And I will be able to play this. So what you need to do is with your criteria, whether you know whatever those criteria that you chose, come to this side, click on it, and find the same ones. They're all here. They just look a little different than the data uh, area you had to go to. And so click. If I go on education, I click. I come straight across because if you go, uh, you can, well, it's not doing it now. So there it is. Schooling costs, expenditure, uh, secondary, primary. You, you, you pick what you want. Gender equality, ratio of girls and boys. You come over here. And now those countries' data are, relation, are, are relative to um, ratio of girls and boys. Then you come up here and you do another one. So write your report that way. I hope this has been helpful. Um, if you have difficulties and you're not sure what I'm doing and this is not making good sense to you, please email me and we'll meet on, on Thursday and I'll walk you through it again. Okay? I hope this has been helpful. I'm sorry I didn't know that they were going to change the uh, website uh, before we had to get this assignment in. So if you've noticed the announcement, 
It's now not due until the 29th, and please post it as a PDF. And I've left the journal open where it was in week 9. It'll stay open until the 29th at 5 p.m., at which time it'll close. Okay, so I hope that's been more, more helpful, and um, um, good luck with it. I'm looking forward to seeing them. All right, now, bye.